Welcome. Oh, oh. Give me that This is a guide to show you how to get the map. As you saw on the screen a second ago, there is a map location it's in the desert bit, which is called the archive. It's in the big red patch thing. So I'm going to show you on the map here. It's on the left side. There's a little ring thing. It's go through the ruins and go straight down you see this massive map on the floor that's what we're going to be building and the white ghost so we go up to the white ghost and when we talk to her she'll give us the cattle craft which is the map so when we afraid, learn this we can actually learn have you come the map. to seek a way so free of the bonding bracelet you now we can get the materials so There's we can get the map up and running so we can start learning so first thing is i've gone up to the volcano pathway which leads straight up and there's loads of obsidian here or we don't need obsidian but if you see it on the thing that every time i'm hitting it it's giving me some gold and this is a really good place to get gold silver and crystal for the map and there's if up along this place where I've gone, I've only ever been attacked by two different golems, which are quite easy to kill anyway. But as you see, I'm hitting it and I'm getting my crystal. There's some gold there I just got, but as soon as I get all the gold and the crystal from all these rocks, I will head back to my base and start melting it down to get. Um, gold dust and silver dust. By this trip, I'm hitting about 20 different rocks, so I end up getting like about a thousand obsidian. So like I've just gone past the top of the hill where the little ruin is, whatever it is. But, um, ah! And he took me up two hits and it's dead. I haven't upped my strength either, I've just I've just played it normally. I haven't changed any settings on my server. I'm like you see I'm hitting and getting bits and bobs. Loads and loads of obsidian, but we don't really need that, but it's always good to have some more crystal there. Raw dust if you need some. As soon as I feel like all this area. Yeah. Oh, there's some gold dust here. Gold. As soon as we get all this gold and silver back to the base, then we can melt it down. Some more gold, more gold, more gold. That's it. Now. But we've got 22 golds and a load of crystal from that. I didn't get no silver this run, but. It's only two bad guys and I come back here again and I can get loads more silver. So now I'm gonna put it in my forge to cook it, which is making me gold bars, which is at seven. Now I'm gonna put it into my grinder and let every one gives you ten bits of gold dust. So that's a plenty of love gold I just did in that one run. I'm going to do a few more runs and show you a different place to get gold and silver. So I've got 70 out of those 7 bars I've got. Now, see, so you, you need to make alchemist paste and you need to make corrupt, corrupted stone. So, corrupted stone and alchemy paste, you need to put ichor, which, if you saw, I put blue fish into the cooking pot to make ichor. That I'm putting back in corruption zone. There you go. Gold dust, ichor, and silver, and stone. And you need dragon blood, which now I will show you how to get dragon blood. I found a nice, easy kind of way to get it. All you have to kill is a load of bats. There is loads of other places to get it, but this is quite close to my place, so I'm just coming here because it's quite a nice place. There's two paths, one down the bottom, and there's one up here. There's two different cages. 
So you go along this little path where I'm going. You've got to climb a little bit, but it's only like a couple of seconds. And these bats here have demons, but as long as you use a pig cat, it's not a pick. See, yeah, I'm using the wrong thing here, but I still get dragon's blood lane. But you would get more from a pickaxe. Demons, yeah. See, so yeah, I've got one there. Now I've just run into the cave and there's like more battles here, so I'm trying to get back. using my pick this time. And as you see, look, there's some more dragon's blood. And some more demons. Oh, I keep saying dragons, but demons, but. Yeah, I've got 10 so far, I've only killed 3 different bad guys. Right, up here there's a place to the left and there's a place up there on the right. So you can climb up the round and get some more bats. I'm just going to climb up here, there's one up here. There's a couple more around the room, room but I'm not going to show you every single person up here. The cave at the bottom, which is here now, which I'm in now, you, you run along the path below the path that I took. Because the path I originally took was, went up and went down. If you go down, it leads to this cave. And the cave where that's two dragons. I think there's about 10 or 15 bats in this one as well. So they are quite difficult sometimes, but they, you know, I used the wrong thing again. So I didn't get much dragon blood from that one. Demon's blood. But yeah, if you look around, there's this whole canyon, and at the bottom there's a little thing that has loads of bats in it. But now, if you see right now, there's loads of shipwrecks everywhere. I don't think I showed you where I was, but it's in the jungle, there's loads of shit mate. But you see that because there's a box there. Click it, open it, it gives you two silver bars. And there's another one just around the corner from here as well, which along here there's another shipwreck. So there's probably another box so we can loot it. There it is, around the corner. This one has two silver and one coin. And the shipwreck. I think that not every shipwreck will have one, but quite a lot of them do. And there's there are particular places where you can get every single one. I could do another video of getting gold and silver if need be later on. Might as well. Oh yeah. So on that little run, me living around, there's eight coin, eight gold, fourteen silver, and a load of silver bars as well. If I grind all the coins down, I'll get tons of silver and gold dust. And now I can make my alchemy paste and demon's blood, which I got from the bats, make me corruption stones. That's not the best place to get demons blood, but it works for me, and I've just got the tons of it. You know, I need 50 crystal, 35 iron ringlets, which are quite easy to get, and corruption stone 200, and an alchemist paste 75. So you need a lot of demon blood, pretty much, and gold and, gold and silver dust. Now if you click, I can make I can make it because I've got all the two. Might have to take a few runs trying to get all that stuff where I showed you, but it's doable. And if there's a few of you doing it, you, you can just every ten minutes you can keep coming back to it. Now this is what you create at the end of it. It's a map, and if you see, it looks quite cool. And each one will show you spawn location of where you got. Thank you.